Well guys, today I'm living in Greenville, Illinois. It's not where I want to be. The repair shop. Bubba Box Truck Corey. We got a little problem with the truck. The vacuum pump pulley has seized up and sheared off. All part of the joys of being a nomad, living on the road. What can you do? What can you do, Harley? What can you do? I want some love too, Dad. I do. But, to try and make the best out of a bad situation, there's a grocery store a five minute walk away. We've got a little patch of almost grass back here for the girls. Train track like 50 feet away to keep me entertained every time a train comes by and scares the hell out of me because it is loud. But the sunset is somewhat pretty. There's no one else around to bother me. And we're making out just fine. The folks here at Z1 Auto were kind enough to rush my job to get me out today. Put me in before their other customers. Which was mighty kind of them. Unfortunately, there's no auto parts store in town that had the part I need in stock. So, I'm camping until tomorrow. That's okay. That's what I do, right? Nomad, living on the road. I camp wherever I park. Today, I'm just parked at the mechanic's shop in Greenville, Illinois. I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but a broken pulley kind of right down here. And my serpentine belt now, of course, is too loose because the pulley isn't there to tension it. So, rather than break more stuff by continuing to drive, we are enjoying Greenville, Illinois. You know, if you're thinking about starting nomad life with an older vehicle, you'd best plan for things like this because they're going to happen. Certainly slows down my drive back to Toronto, but it's just part of the deal. If you're going to drive a 20 year old truck cross country, living in it, you're going to break down occasionally. So the quote is about 250 bucks and <laughs> That's just for the pulley. If we have to replace the vacuum pump, it's going to be more. Hopefully, that's not the case. But, I'm trying to stay upbeat and positive. The dogs have found a friend across the road to bark at. And I'm, uh, I'm just going to enjoy the evening. Pretty big shop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine service bays. Fancy tow truck, couple, couple of those. So they should know what they're doing. Get this sorted out for me. Well, guys, the work is beginning. The pulley is in. 9:01 a.m. The mechanic was over, saying he's got the parts. Let's get it done. How do you beat that? So hopefully, all goes well, and we'll be on the road here soon. What do you think of your new backyard? What do you think? I'm gonna eat the grass, Dad. Maybe I can puke tonight. Well, we are back on the road. Before noon, just as I hoped. What do we have? Oh, about 1,300 kilometers to go. The journey continues.